Hello and welcome again my fellow Tubians and welcome to Question Time with James. Um, I have another question on one of my videos um, from, I think you pronounce this, was it Shay Shi Sean? Not actually too sure. Um, but basically he wants to know, uh, what's the website to see any old version of any website? Um, very good question. There is actually a very, very good website that deals with this exact issue. And it's called the Wayback, uh, Wayback Machine. Um, basically, it's an online internet archive, and they're basically archiving sort of old past versions of websites. You know, to basically see how websites have progressed through the years, and for you know to keep them for prosperity for future generations. Um, so we'll just give it a try out now. One of the site I'm actually going to put in is YouTube. So I'll take a look and see what YouTube used to look like. Now as you can see there's 1099 results for YouTube spanning over various different years. Now the Wayback Machine goes back as far as 1996. Now that was when the internet sort of became what it is today and became publicly available. Before that it was called ARPNET which was part of a sort of a scientific research project in conjunction with the military of course. Um, anyway, so let's have a look at what YouTube used to look like when it first came out. Very simple, very basic, but they still had the exact same YouTube logo. So since 2005, the YouTube logo has not changed, although the site has uh, taken many changes over the years. So have a look, September 1st, 2005. So here we are, so we're already starting to sort of look a lot more like what, what we sort of see today. You can still sign up for your free account, you know, upload, share. Uh, giant Squirrel featured on the first page on the 1st of September 2005. How to vlog. Uh, Dodge Charger SRT8 Burnout. Part two. Uh, yeah, so basically the the whole concept was all there. So let's go back. Uh, let's have a look at Google.com. There you go. They launched in 1998, and this was what their first page looked like. <laughs> At that point, they were still in the prototyping stage. So basically, here is the very first Google search page. Now, some of you may remember actually using this page. Um, a lot of you won't, because a lot of my audience um, is a little bit too young to remember sort of websites of, the, of this sort of uh, vintage. Um, I actually remember using this website way back when. And back then, man... It was, oh my god, you know, it was the best thing since the internet had been invented, um, which was only two years previous to that. <laughs> anyway, basically that's how you can f look at any website, and they don't just do, you know, normal, everyday, or sorry, they don't do, you know, big websites, they do sort of normal, everyday websites as well. Um, on a lot of them they don't have sort of too many results. If I do my own website there, I think there's only about three or four. Yeah, there's five page results. Um, which all of which are actually before I took over the, the domain, so none of them actually relate to me at all. Um, anyway, that's how you can go back in time, virtually, and see what the web used to look like. Um, if you have any other questions or anything about YouTube or anything sort of technical in relation to the internet or anything like that, please uh, ask me. I'm actually going to be putting up a uh, poll question system on top of my channel soon. I uh, just need to redesign my layout to match it. Um, so basically, if you have any questions or comments, please ask me, send me a message, leave comments, and I'll see if I can get back to you as quickly as possible. So please comment, rate, and subscribe.